guys, I'm back with some synthetic drip that I'm so excited about for a couple of reasons. One, of course, y'all know it's from Sam's Beauty and y'all know Sam's Beauty is my one-stop shop for all my synthetic hair needs. I absolutely love them. Um, as a matter of fact, it's time to order some conditioner. They sell that too, okay? I absolutely love Sam's Beauty. <laughs> if you look down in the description box, you see a direct link to where you can purchase this unit. Hopefully, you want to purchase um, but as well as Sam's uh, Beauties, all their social medias, go check out their site. Anything you can need, you can find there. They even have stockings for Easter. Go check them out. The other reason why I'm excited and nervous is because y'all know I have not given up on Zuri. Zuri was my most favorite synthetic wig maker. And Zuri and Bobby Boss, it seems like there was a shift in management or something. And they just let Altra and Sensational take over. So I'm hoping that this unit that I picked up from Sam's Beauty is a winner. Let us hope, okay? Even though I see chunky baby hair, and we know I don't have any edges really, that's how anti-baby hair I am. We're gonna see y'all. This one is, like I said, it's by Zuri, and I got it in the style FH Chunky Baby Fayola, F-A-Y-O-L-A, in a gorgeous color, FFT Honey Blunt. The color is beautiful. Okay, Miss Fayola comes with pre-curled, chunky baby hairs. It says gel is enough to style the edges. Um, it's an HD lace front wig. It is heat safe up to 400 degrees. It says trim edges as you desire, slay edges like a pro. So if you are a person that doesn't like them really chunky, this says that you can trim them up and make it do what it do, okay? Let's take fail out of the packaging. That's how excited I was. Y'all know I normally come over here with all that done. I ain't even took it out the pack. Because I was that excited to see. Now, y'all, this color, this honey blonde is it, okay? Y'all know I love an ashy blonde. Hence my head. Hence my hands be a little ashy. And this is a perfect ashy blonde color with some honey highlights in it of course some warmer highlights but that is cute hold on let me take off this tag okay y'all look at that color Ooh. okay so you definitely get some ashy pieces in there but you get some warmer honey blonde pieces and then you have some dark brown pieces in there like an ash brown that is a very pretty blend i will give zuri that as far as cap construction, you get ear-to-ear -ear lace, you get a comb to the right, a comb to the left, and you get that curved part, okay? Um, and then in the back, you also get a comb and an adjustable strap, okay? Before I cut off this lace, let's put Miss Fayola on my head. No stocking cap, so you guys can see, and it's a, a left part. Yeah, it's a left part. For those of you that are like, y'all, them baby hairs really aren't bad. And like I say all the time, I'm team no baby hair. Y'all, those really aren't bad. Okay, this is Fayola straight out of the pack. Y'all, dare I say that's not that bad? Those are those baby hairs. They have already curled them, so they kind of swoop to where they're supposed to lay. I can appreciate that. Y'all, this really isn't a bad wig. It fits very comfortably on my head as well. I am getting a little bit of shine up here, but you know that dry shampoo will fix that shine. Okay, cute. Cute, cute, cute. All right, let's cut the lace off Miss Fayola. Play around with it, and then I'll be back with my final thoughts, you guys. Be right back.
thoughts on Faola. And dare I say that Zuri pleasantly surprised me with this one, even though I'm team no baby hair. Y'all, this is a nice wig though. I'm not getting any shedding, any tangling, and you might say it's straight out of the pack, but y'all know uh, the past couple of Zuri units that I reviewed, they did tangle straight out of the pack. And I am honestly not getting that with this one. I do absolutely love the color. Um, and to be honest with y'all, the baby hairs, even though I'm team no baby hair, they are chunky, but they are easy to manipulate. So I can give them that this wig said that it is doing exactly what it claimed. Um, the only major con that I have about this, and it's so easily easy to fix, is it is shiny. It does come across as shiny, but some dry shampoo on this would make this work. Can I recommend this unit? Actually, yes, I can. And it feels so good to finally say that about a Zuri unit, y'all. Because, oh, Lord. And I'm excited because after this one, I'm about to film a Bobby Boss unit because that's another company that I've just been like, where yet? Where yet? Okay. Um, Zuri, I'm glad to see them turning this around. I definitely re can recommend that you go pick this one up from Sam's Beauty. I put a link down there to where you can purchase her. Um, I also love this color. And in my head, I was trying to say, I know that I've done Zuri's Honey Blonde before. And it didn't look this ashy. But I can appreciate the ashiness of this one. Y'all, I really do like this unit. I do recommend it. And if you like chunky baby hairs or if you think you can manipulate these baby hairs, just know that they carry other wigs in this um, series, this chunky series, and Sam's Beauty carries them as well. Mm -hmm. Like I would say, maybe you're not into wigs. Maybe it is your little cousin, Fayola. Maybe it's your Uncle Fernando. Whichever one, if you send them to me and I send them to Sam's Beauty, I promise they'll find a unit that they like, y'all. In the comments, talk to me. What are y'all thoughts on baby hairs? Y'all know, I, uh, you know I'm team no baby hair, but what are your thoughts on baby hairs? And what are your thoughts on Zuri hopefully bouncing back in 2024? Mm -hmm. Until next time, would you be very, very soon?